The capture of Fort Ticonderoga in May of 1775 was the first significant American victory in the American Revolution. Located on the shores of Lake Champlain in northern New York, the fort was strategically important as it controlled access to Canada and the Hudson Valley. Previously a French garrison named Fort Carillon, it was captured by the British and renamed in 1759. On May 9th, Benedict Arnold and Ethan Allen, along with 80 Green Mountain boys, rode across Lake Champlain and stormed the fort in a swift late-night attack. There were no serious injuries on either side. After Allen departed, Benedict Arnold took command of the fort until he was relieved in June. In the winter, Henry Knox was sent to Fort Ticonderoga to collect 59 cannons and howitzers and transported them to Boston during the spring siege. The Patriots held onto the fort until July 1777, when the Redcoats recaptured it. After the Saratoga surrender, the Americans retook control of the fort in November 1777.